do you want to know? Do you want to know if your child is bullying someone online? Do you want to know if your child's being bullied? Do you want to know if your child is sending inappropriate pictures online? Do you want to know if your child is receiving inappropriate pictures? Do you want to know if a predator has contacted your child? Do you want to know if your child is speaking with someone they shouldn't be speaking with and providing private information? These are just a few of the questions that I want you to ask yourself today. And if you answer yes to every single one of those, then we have to make sure that we're taking a look at their devices. As I'm continuing to navigate kids, devices, all the stuff that's going on with COVID and has made things weird with device time going through the roof. While we want to give our kids grace, while we want to understand the space that they are in, what I want to help you understand is by checking their devices, you are not invading their privacy. Every single one of those questions I just asked, I answer yes to. I want to know if someone's contacting my child. I want to know if my child is sending or receiving inappropriate pictures. I want to know if my child's being bullied or if they are bullying someone. Why? Because the consequences on the backside of that have life altering results. If they're sending inappropriate pictures, there's a legal issue. If they are contacting someone and giving out private information, they are endangering themselves. If a predator has contacted your child, if a predator's contacted my child, it endangers them. I want to know. If my child is bullying someone, either through text messages or online through social media, I want to know. Because the mental health consequences on the other side of that are massive. Massive. I want to know if my child's being bullied. Again, mental health consequences are huge and lifelong. So again, I ask the question, do you want to know or would you want to know? If you are answering yes, please, this is my tip for you guys. Pick up the device, take a look at it. Not every day, not every hour, once a week, maybe twice a week, once every other week, but we're looking and we are having those open conversations. And if we see things that we don't like, then we're putting in place the necessary steps to protect your child and to protect other children. Because one of the things that our children do not understand in the online space is that they have or the their behavior has consequences that affects others. And so that's where we come into play. When we want to know, when we take a look, then we can intervene and we can stop things before they get out of hand. We can stop things before there are legal issues. Would you want to know? Do you want to know? You're not invading their privacy. You're being a really good parent. You're digging in. You're having the hard conversations. And that's how we protect our kids. If you're having trouble in the space. You can't figure it out. If it feels like too much, I am here. My information is below. It's everywhere. You guys know where to find me. I'll help you. I will help you answer those questions. I will teach you how to know. Thank you.